Adrian, after such a good first half performance, I'm sure you must have been sweating a bit in the second half as they closed the gap because it looked as if you might throw that game away. Aye, that's for sure. Hey. You know, the first half we were five points up, and you know we're in the second half, and they got the first three or four scores, and the back end a couple of points. But in fairness, the boys, they, you know, they held their nerve and they kept at it. You know, and they got a, uh, you know a couple of important scores. You know, towards the end there. Yeah. You know, what do you think happened in the second half? Because you just played such good football in the first half. I would say we just hit the blocks running the first half, and the second half, you know, Red Hughes came out at us. You know, so it was really weathering the storm. You know. And, yeah, you know, but nervous is there maybe. Oh, of course, a lot, 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 lot of young, young boys, you know, you know, that maybe from first first final, you know. So it's it's uh, it was the training now. If I say to so myself, <laughs> yeah. And listen, you, you, I don't know whether you're aware or not, but they didn't score from play in the second half. All their scores came from frees. So you were defending well, and 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 he kicked a few good frees from out the pitch as well. Ah, uh, well, you at the start of the game, we, we you know we were wanting to get the fouls as much down as much as possible could because we knew Gallon inside was always going to cause a problem with free kicks, you know, and uh, the second half. Well, he did, you know, he didn't miss very, very many now at all, you know. So, yeah. but uh, no, it's been, you know, it's, as I say, it's been a tight old year, you know, for for the whole parish and different things, and yes. you know, for these boys to come together and do what they've done today. Let's just hope now the double whammy now for the seniors. Absolutely. And Adrian, really, after the disappointment of last year, sometimes it's very hard to motivate a team to come back again. I mean, you were close last year, but you put the disappointment of that behind you and come out really and, and did well in a tough group. I. 100% like last year you know it was a disappointment I was the back of the team myself last year you know and uh, getting beats not a nice feeling you know we've got a lot of younger boys getting through from minors and some boys that weren't playing got them back into the mix eh? and you know green older ones old heads and yeah, new heads it's, yeah. it's a good mix that really there. was a secret of success because you had very experienced players there but you had good legs there as well when the, when the going got tough yeah you know they're like a Paddy Joe there and Cobby you know, and then you know, big Mike McCoss in the middle of the field that, you know, that they played senior a couple of years ago, Paddy Cannon, and then they had Cormac Coyle, Jeremy Coyle, all them young pups that came through. Hey, it's uh, Neil Kelly, hey, all runners, hey, to probably sort the whole lot of them. Hey. Yeah, big day for the club now with the seniors coming out here, and as you say, it's been a tough year, tough circumstances for everybody, Adrian. It'll be some boost now if you did the double oh, here today. It'll be massive, hey, it'll be absolute massive with the parish, hey. There's no, be no doubt, hey, the seniors go at it too as hard as we did.